We get this question all the time. How in the world can I sell my Summit County property during the winter months? Well, it's true conventional wisdom and history both show that properties sell more likely here in the summer than they do in the winter. Some of that is because our buyers are coming back in the summer months to look at properties more so than the winter. In the winter, they typically come for skiing and snowboarding and winter adventures, and then they'll return in the summer to look at properties. But also with all that snow on the ground, think about this. If you've got a single family detached home, your buyer probably would like to take a look at the landscaping, the topography around the home and know what's under all that snow. It is still possible to get top dollar for your Summit County property during the winter months. You just have to know a couple of key things to do to make the sale happen. Hi, it's Pete Dininger with the Breck Life Group right here in Breckenridge. And in this video, I'm gonna share with you my three tips to get the most money possible for your winter home sale. Okay, first up on the list, first impressions matter. We know that in real estate, first impressions mean everything. So within this one point, I have two tips for you. Number one, let's make sure the exterior of your home is really, you've got great curb appeal. In the winter months here at 10,000 feet above sea level, you wanna think about making sure the driveway is plowed, your walkways are shoveled, let's have your decks free and clear of snow because your buyer wants to know what it's gonna look like. What's the access gonna be like? They don't wanna to have to trudge through two feet of snow to even get to your front door. That's gonna be a terrible first impression. We also want to think about the interior of the home, and I've talked about this in other videos. If you can take the time to do a pre-listing home inspection, we can determine what kinds of things have maybe been neglected or overlooked. Let's make any of those necessary repairs before we hit the market. Touch up paint, clean, tidy up, clean up the surfaces. First impressions matter, and in the winter, even more so. Okay, step number two, we want to create a warm and inviting atmosphere inside your property. I have had several sellers who were not here living in their homes and they wanted to save a little bit of money by keeping the inside temperature at 55 degrees. And I can tell you that a buyer's first impression when they walk inside your home and it's cool, they take off their shoes because they're polite and now they're walking around in their stocking feet on a, a cold floor that's 55 degrees, the first thing they wanna do is get out of there. So we wanna make a warm, and inviting atmosphere. If you are living in the home, consider lighting a couple of candles. We really want it to be warm and cheery and inviting for your buyers when they walk in. Uh, most importantly, it's got to be the temperatures. During the cold winter months, we need it to be nice and toasty for a buyer so they want to spend more time in your property and looking at all the beautiful finishes. And step number three, we need to let in as much natural light as possible. We know that in Colorado during the winter months, the days are shorter and the sun is lower in that southern sky. So especially with all the snow that we get here, if it happens to be a snowy day, there's not all that natural light outside, we really wanna make sure we get all the curtains and blinds open, all the lights turned on for every showing. If you are not here, we're gonna come through and prep your home for every single showing. Make sure the temperature is right, that was tip number two, and make sure that we bring in as much natural light as possible. We don't want a feeling of gray and doom and gloom inside your property. We wanna make it as inviting as possible for potential buyers to spend as much time in your home as possible. Well, that wraps up my three tips to prepare your home as best as possible for a winter sale. Here in Summit County, we know the days are shorter, lots of snow outside, so many things to consider when preparing and marketing your home for a winter sale. 
This is what we do day in and day out. So if you have questions, if you're thinking of selling, reach out. We have a lot more tips and strategies to get your property sold this winter. Thanks very much.